Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the InnoVista bar raise chart as a Power BI custom visual. This component was generated automatically in the InnoVista animator and exported so that it can be deployed in Power BI. The visual allows a designer to present a bar chart which updates with animation as it progresses through the data, typically time periods. A user can pause or browse through each individual time period. Here are two examples with data sources containing thousands of rows. The first is the evolution of brand values and the second Olympic medal history by country. Open Power BI Desktop or online and the first step is to load and define the data. Here we will use Excel but the data could just as easily come from any supported source. The data are in column format and contain periods, an item name and value. We could also add a color for each item if required. Now we can import the bar raise chart. On the Visualization tab, select the three dots to either import the visual from a file or from app source. Here, we will import from the file system. Then click on the new visual icon to load it onto the canvas and resize. The visual will be a stock image until data are loaded. To link the data to the visual, we drag the data item in the Fields tab to the equivalent field in the visual. I will start by dragging year to chart periods. In this case, we don't want summary information. We want to use each row of data. So click the down arrow next to the visual field and select Don't Summarize. We will do this for each data item where relevant. Note that if you do not want the image to animate during setup, open the Format tab. Find the Run Animation option, open it and set it to Off. Don't forget to set this back to On when ready. We have quite a number of options we can use in the Format section to help us set up the visual the way we want. In format, we can edit properties to change the look and feel as well as behavior of the chart. The tick duration sets the time in milliseconds for a bar to update for a period. 1000 milliseconds means one second. The delay duration is the time gap between two different periods. The top end option sets the number of items shown sorted by the largest value. We also want to set the label, font size and color for the x-axis. There are also options for sorting, the period indicator, the value tax, number formats and chart margins. Thank you for watching. If you would like to find out how to create your own Power BI animated visuals, please check the links below or search for InnoVista Animator in YouTube.